Hi students, again I am going to revision second chapter in your social. What is the second chapter? Do you know? Yes, exactly where you are living that particular area which is showing us yes map okay, in atlas also what you will find different uh, maps you may find right very good today i am uh, revise maps chapter should listen carefully some important points which are there very well so you must have to listen and keep in your mind okay first introduction of the map map which is showing us one particular area or it is showing particular place or village or town or district or state or country or continent this is showing us through the map you may get one particular area if you want to go to from one place to another place map may helpful to you it is the introduction of the map okay next student heading globes and maps okay already you have learned about globe in first chapter globe is a uh, model of the earth okay the globe also is showing us continents and oceans some particular important countries places cities na but uh, through the map you may find mentally different uh, okay things etc also okay what are the things you are watching on the globe more than that you may get uh, through the map okay that's why you must have to be listen carefully okay so you observed uh, map is very easy to carry from one place to another place you can keep in your packet or your bag but globe it is difficult to carry from one place to another place that's why student you must have to okay no difference between the globe and map map is easy to carry from one place to another place but globe it is not easy to carry from one place to another place okay it is the most accurate way of looking at the size shape and location of the place on the earth however it has several okay shortcomings that's why you may observe that uh, uh, things uh, you may observe entirely different between the globe and maps next you observe it is not possible to be see all the parts of the earth surface at the same time is it possible seeing all places at the same time on the globe no it is not possible but it is possible through the map you can see which map you want to know which country if you want to know which state if you want to know particular map if you take that map which may give entirely uh, um, full uh, details uh, you may get through the map students not only that it cannot so uh, details information to get uh, detailed information we will have to make hug globes they will be difficult to make and read on the globe what are the things you are watching and seeing which may not give entirely eh, uh, full details but through the map you may get full details okay 
to avoid these problems we normally use map instead of the globe that's why okay it is uh, entirely different between the globe and the map okay so globe is a very uh, uh, big is the that's why it is not possible to keeping in your pocket or your bag um, you can't carry anywhere everywhere if you want to go so uh, and uh, it is not showing uh, all particular places okay it is not giving full details but map is giving which one is useful to you uh, globe is useful or map is useful yes map is more useful than the globe okay the uh, science of making maps is called cartography okay so science of the making map is what called cartography okay, who are the drawing the map who are the making the map we are calling them they are the cartographers who are the cartographer cartographers are drawing the map and making the map that's why we are calling them cartographer some of the oldest maps made by the women are more than 8000 years ago okay 8000 years ago cartographers has draw different maps uh, that maps which are uh, giving us entirely different different uh, information not only that student okay claudius uh, um potlemy was a greek mathematician and geographer who lived in egypt more than 20 sorry 2000 years ago he created several maps of the world who did created several maps of the world in different place a yes, several maps of the world uh, was created or drawn by the okay, cleodius uh, ptolemy he was uh, one of the good mathematician and geographer you may know students not only that uh, next heading what is a map map is a drawing of the earth surface or a part of it and a flat surface such as sheets of the paper map is showing us on the earth what are the things are there for example mountains okay and forest or uh, in that uh, soils different type of the soils and uh, you may know different uh, type of the grasslands etc so on uh, or rivers uh, oceans uh, seas etc so on you may know that's why map which is showing earth surface entirely different different land forms you may find students and next heading different type of the maps what are the different type of the maps yes many different type of the maps uh, especially you may know uh, in this chapter you are learning uh, okay uh, two important different type of the maps one is a physical map one more is political map one is physical map one more is political map see political map is showing us especially country state okay cities district and uh, entirely different to uh, towns whatever the boundaries are there that are showing as which map political map but uh, physical map showing us especially mountains forests grasslands rivers oceans 
okay different land forms and different mines etc you may find through the uh, physical map okay students not only that and uh, again different type of the maps are there that one you will learn in a sixth class only this is uh, only brief information why because only up to this much only your portion so this much you learn and again more type of the maps you may learn in a coming class student not only that listen carefully students the large the area covered by a map the more will be the error in it a map of your neighborhood can be draw accurately as it is covered a small area but a map of the India or a map of the world will have errors because they covered very large area. Okay, your neighbors places you may observe different boundaries. They are drawn entirely different. Why? Why? They, why? Because their land this much that like that. And they may so through the map. Okay. Anyway, the map of the world so uh, uh, on page number. Uh, of this uh, book you may watch uh, uh, world map uh, in uh, page number 12 how is there how, how it was uh, drawn uh, what th things uh, you are uh, watching on that okay oh, some wall maps also as um, there if you are uh, keeping your home uh, on the wall that is we are calling that is wall map if you want to see different um, maps uh, you may find in a atlas a book of map is called an atlas what is atlas a book of map is called an atlas a book of map is called an atlas what is political maps maps showing boundaries of the countries and states and the important cities are known as a political map what is physical map is yes. uh, physical map uh, showing uh, physical maps are showing natural features of the land such as mountains rivers and uh, plains such as mountains rivers plains etc you may see which map is showing us physical map is showing as maps uh, source okay crops grown or minerals found in various places map is showing even about uh, crops also and it is saying uh, showing us the different minerals uh, places also not only that student maps shows uh, rain fall in different areas in which place rain is falling how it was there whether huh? you may get through the map on particular location how was there how is there how will be there the climate in different place so that's why map shows rainfall in different uh, areas also not only that student maps showing roads railways and uh, airline roads map is showing railways roadways and uh, yeah, airline routes also through the map you may know student very good next elements of a map what are the important elements of a map is especially you are learning here some elements of the maps one is directions second scale third color and uh, five Sorry, fourth one, symbols, directions, colors, scale, and symbol. What are the four directions, students? Is exactly the four directions uh, you may know: north, south, east, and west. Say, everyone, with me. First one, north. South, 
east and west these are the four directions you may know this the di four directions are we are calling cardinal directions what are these four directions are we are calling these four directions are cardinal directions through the direction you may easily get that about information particularly which place is there which place that all things are available huh? you may easily go through the direction from one place to another place also okay some one place to another place also student okay especially almost which side sun is rising yes east you have to keep in your mind sun is rising always east side and the sunset is coming yes sunset uh, may happen especially west side almost top side we are calling north uh, down side bottom side we are calling south you must have to keep in your mind top is north bottom is south sun rises east sunset is west this is the four cardinal directions okay students not only that you may know different okay <coughs> some sub directions also if north is at the top then south is at the bottom east is the right and west is the left if you know north east lines between north and east and north south between the north and west south east between the south and west south west between the south and west like this also you may find this is the sub okay directions uh, north east north west south east and south west also okay now students next about scale through the scale you may measure particular areas for the drawing the map you may use scale through that you may draw map uh, entirely in small but uh, that area actually it is there so uh, through that okay map already so that the actual distance between the place the scale of a map it is the ratio between the distance so on the map and actual distance on the ground scale is showing actual distance student okay for example also you may know how is it in your textbook particularly is there read textbook carefully and get information just when i am revising this all things and liner scale also each division is the bar is one centimeter uh, on the map and uh, indicate on the hundred kilometers like that if one centimeter approximately you have to think uh, like that one hundred kilometers like that you have to draw your downside uh, Mm, uh, world map is there now like that only they have drawn very good student you have to understand next colors head next heading is color color different places which were showing in different to important colors water bodies are showing us which color yes exactly water bodies are showing us blue color okay mountains are showing us brown color okay <coughs> grasslands are showing us our plants are showing us green color like that every different particular area showing us different to one one color student you must have to know that all things properly and to learn carefully and next heading symbols last heading is a symbols okay through the symbols you may get easily about to that uh, particular area okay suppose you are going from one place to another place on the road some symbols are appearing as okay through that uh, you may get uh, why because if bridge symbol is there means coming 
Huh? Okay, 500 meters uh, bridge symbol is there. Or uh, PO is there means near the post office is there. PS is there. PS is a uh, police station is there. Okay, or other symbols like boundaries or C or how uh, capital of the country etc. Reverse symbol we may watch or church symbol is there means near the church is there mosque is there means there so uh -huh, mosque symbol or uh, one place temple is there means that the place temple also is there you may know students hey, thank you students in this uh, chapter especially i have revised this uh, introduction of the map globe and maps okay not only that i uh, uh, revise about what is a map and revise a different type of the maps what are the different type of maps you learned especially political maps and physical maps yes and the elements of the map especially directions what are the four directions north east west south you can uh, next you learn about scale also you can measure you can draw easily and colors uh, which particular physical boundary physical places through the colors you may know and symbols through the symbols you may get easily thank you students read the chapter and learn all question answers be ready for the midterm exam from this chapter also some questions will come for the midterm exam as well as objectives also will come okay bye students